everyone and welcome for another video where today we are back in another five nights of the theorem but it's not theorem that much anyways right here you're seeing a picture of five nights of Freddy's, the movie by Warner Bros is the straw or not we don't know exactly but think but Warner Bros well when I checked then it was released when do you think it is, guys? August? When was it said? I we I we're not sure about the date yet. We couldn't find, but one of those has the rights, has the rights for Five Nights at Freddy's. But this is what some people have to say. The original video will be in the description down below. For me, that's it. Bye. -bye. Warner Brothers Pictures has just picked up the rights and is going into development on a feature film adaptation of the popular game Five Nights at Freddy's. Five Nights at Freddy's challenges players to survive for five nights as a security guard in a demented pizza entertainment restaurant where homicidal and possessed animatronics roam the halls in search of their next victims. Mod, buy or sell a Five Nights at Freddy's movie. Bye, 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 <laughs> bye, 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 <laughs> and I'll tell you why, 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 why. It's a um, musical episode. Because, the, um, this is a video game where it's become a cult hit. I mean, to, to kind of put it into perspective, this is the go into the mirror and whisper Candyman three times to it. This right. is the movie you challenge your friends to play with lights off and a really good headset. I bought the game to stream it live and I freaked out. I couldn't even do it. I couldn't bring myself to play the game because it's that freaky. This is like the pinnacle of horror video game, survival horror. So to make this into a movie about animatronics that want to kill you at night and you're a security guard roaming around just trying to live, this is fantastic. I hate horror. I don't like the genre genre remotely but i'm so excited for horror fans to really have like this is going to whet their appetite this is going to be fantastic and the team that bought the rights to this and are working on it i think is the same team that's doing the remake of it these mm. guys are the mm. most sadistic people on the universe <laughs> getting all the things that you know uh, live in everyone's nightmares and bringing it to life so i'm just excited for you horror fans out there because this is going to not only get the credibility of games moving over to movies which some work and we're kind of doing a little bit more and no, more. No, some have not worked. Some ha None have ever worked in the history of mankind. Well, Mortal Kombat worked and we're still oh waiting God. for the next one, <laughs> which we could get very we're soon. We're seeing it happen more and more and the possibility that it could work and this could be a movie mm. from a game that does and that's exciting. Yeah, uh, no, no, I love Mortal Kombat. But in, yeah. in love, so I also acknowledge not. it's an awful movie, <laughs> but I love it. Um, all video game movies suck and I, yet I'm going to buy this. Uh, now, I don't know, is Five Nights at Freddy, does that have a console version? Or is it just is it straight if mobile? If it is, it's going to be on Xbox Live or PSN. Okay, because the I played it. I played it on uh, on the mobile version of it, which I think is what it was originally no, created. No, at. No, you got to play it on a Mac or a PC. No, no, I, I played it. Well, you had no. I see. Here's how I got it. I, I was laying in bed, and I got my my tablet out, and I got keep had a friend of mine keep telling me you got to try this game Five Nights at Freddy's. And first of all, I should say this: no video game in the history of video games have ever been even remotely scary. I mean, I've, I've looked. It's it's a video game. There's nothing. <laughs> it's a game. Um, even if you, you make things that are supposed to be scary, it's a game. None of it's scary. Whoa, no, it's so much more scary because you are playing that game and you are the character within the yeah, game. Yeah, there's there's just a disconnect there for me personally that I've never found Play any out last. game even remotely frightening. But so I'm laying in bed. Friends say, oh, get to try this game, Five Nights at Freddy's. It's really fun, blah, blah, blah. And it's funny. There's the voice recordings of the old security guard. It was really, really funny. I'm like, okay. So I load it up. I swear, I swear, about 30 seconds in, I'm like, nope. And I put it down. The <laughs> like the the game is so creepy. Yeah. It's so creepy, yet funny at the same time. Nothing funny about it. Yeah. So like I tried it again. Like an hour later, picked up again. Okay, because it's at night. I'm laying in bed and it's dark. And like another minute later, nope. <laughs> <laughs> it was. It has got that potential. The story of this is really rather interesting. Look, this could be the next in a very long line of horrible attempted game adaptations. But I think there's some potential here. So for me, this is going to be a buy. This is a huge buy for me if they do it right. And it sounds like they have the right team in place. This could be Night at the Museum, except you're leaving behind all that family crap. This is just <laughs> trying to scare people. And who hasn't been to a Chuck E. Cheese and you see the Country Bears plan? You're like, I wonder what is inside their creepy heads. Or 
even like, like when I was a kid, they had the Teddy Ruxpin dolls. Thank God my oh, parents yeah. never got me a Teddy Ruxpin doll because that's the scariest looking thing <laughs> in retrospect I've ever seen. Something like that coming to life is such a cool premise. And I was on, I was, I was tooting your horn until about a week ago when I went up to my brother's place and played his PS4 and I played that PT, which was like the precursor oh, yep, yep, yep. to what was supposed to be Silent Hill 4. I was scared out of my mind playing that. So video games can do the horror genre very well. And I think this is going to be a great crossover.